It's a really great moment. It, it's, all, it's slightly surreal, I'll be honest with you, at this stage. You know, the amount of times you walk through uh, Leicester Square or you see the red carpet being laid out for a movie um, that's going to be shown here. I had my first film here 12 years ago. I never dreamed in that moment that I'd ever come back as the filmmaker behind the opening film, so it's incredible. And a really important story. What, what was it about this story that you wanted to tell? Well, I mean, there were so many important elements of it, but, you know, how racism can be um, not just a sort of surface, explicit um, act, but how it can be subversive, how it can, how, how much damage it can cause in many ways, but also the power of love and courage when when placed together um, the power of standing up for what you believe in I want people to be uplifted when they leave this story I want them to know about an African history um, and a British history that hasn't really been talked about that much. I want them to be able to see a black man up on the screen walking through the streets of London in the 1940s in the way that we've not really been allowed to see. I want them to see a woman's experience, a British woman's experience of being in Africa and, and how a sisterhood is developed with those women. There's so much really in this story that I love and that I'm that I'm attached to and that I hope, you know, will will lend itself to the hearts of, of everybody that goes to see it. Yeah, it's an important bit of history that almost, you know, a lot of us kind of don't know about absolutely but it feels relevant to now as well which in some ways is sad I guess yes I mean I think what period dramas often do historical dramas often do is allow us a benchmark with which to measure either how far we've come or how far we still have to go and we have come a long way but we still got a ways to go Zane's got a, a, a great voice I'll just leave it at that. I wanted to meet you. Oh, uh, yeah, we haven't met each other yet. Got some lipstick on oh. your teeth.